Hello my fellow gamers, welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Red Ever Extension 2. Last time we hit 35.6%. We got the ability to be, get rid of stolen horses. And we're gonna get rid of our beard. How selfish are you? Are you even aware of the price on my head? The pressures I'm under? If you'd only talk to me, that sounds like a good idea. I want to help you, Dutch, but there's this wall. You can help. And I want to change my hair a little bit. So I can actually think for once. All right. You're a bastard, Dutch. So. Stuck on something. We gotta figure out our next mission today. So I'm trying to figure out. We have a lot of stuff to do still. I mean, there is a great big pile of stuff to do. Um, for example, I have throwing knives. I just need. Uh, can you... Is that over here? Is he? Nope. Where is he? I could have just went to Josiah. I always go to Josiah. Alright, so. A lot of stuff still to go. 35.6. I'm trying to figure out the best. Mr. Morgan! Mr. Morgan! I've noticed you've stopped paying into the box. My best sort of busy, Miss Grimshaw. Mm. Well, we all need to eat, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Well, I'm broke. I've been buying stuff that's important. I don't care about money. Alright. I'll give you a dollar. I want a dollar. So we're gonna... The guy that, like, most people hate in this camp, we're gonna go visit. So that should be a fun time. That was great to Are you busy, Arthur? Why? Well, I know you think I'm just some thick buffoon. A what? A man of words and not of action. Hardly a man at all. Well, I think you're as slippery as an eel in an oil slick, but still a man. Because I think I've... I've found something interesting. Yeah? Have you ever robbed a stagecoach? No, never. Well, who would have even thought? Of course I robbed a goddamn stagecoach. You know I have. And what's the problem with stagecoaches? The armed man attempting to put a bullet in your head? Not quite. The odds. I mean, is it worth the robbing? Sometimes. I know. But, well, if you'd like to come with me, I can introduce you to a new best friend, and he's he's going to give you all the decent, robbable stagecoaches a hot-blooded degenerate could require. Well, I could require a whole lot. So where do we find this friend of yours? Roads. Because what can right? possibly go wrong there? Well, lead the way and we'll find out. Okay, so we're going to roads. That's not where I expected this to go. I you sure you know. seem to have got a bout around here. You know me. I like to make friends in low places. How the hell you end up down here anyway? I could ask the same of you. I have a few commitments over this way. Some expenses to meet. Expenses? What expenses? Gentlemen's canes and rabbits to pull out of hats? Among other things, I had quite a nice little business going for a while. Shares in a gold mining company. Excellent returns for the investor of a certain financial standing. Until, well, that unfortunate run-in with the yeah, oh, that's out. how it goes. Thanks for disappearing on us during that Sean business, by the way. I've done my part. Each to their strengths, dear boy. You know... You boys should really watch yourselves with those two families. This is a small town. People talk. I tried to mention it to Osea, but you know how he is. Here we are. We can hitch up outside. I'll make the introductions, Arthur. Don't use road weapons here in roads. It's a bad idea. I know, it's... 
You hear this every time. You can't rob town folk here. Come on. Hang back a bit and let me do the talking. We don't want to scare him off. I thought he didn't even push the door open, he just walked right through it and it just opened for him. Hello, Alden. Hello, Josiah. How have you been? Dandy. And you, friend? Uh, like I said, times are tough. My missus is a bad woman. Terrible woman. They often are. But how's work, Alden? Terrible. Wages got cut again. They reckon they just invented a new horse's carriage will be the end of us. <laughs> They've been saying that nonsense since they invented the wheel. The witness of bosses. I know. My comrades here and I are greatly discouraged from the adequate fulfillment of our duty. A discouraged man is no man at all, Alden. No man at all. My friend Arthur here has a present for you. Ain't you kind, sir? Call him Arthur. He's one of us, a fellow man of distinction. Okay. Well, this is perfect timing. I think you'll like this one, Josiah. It'll be coming south down the river road through Siltwater Strand. Thank you, Alden. Thank you very much. Oh, and Josiah, if you or Arthur are ever out Strawberry Way, Ask for my colleague there, feller called Hector. He's also one of the, what did you call us again? Discouraged men, Alden. That's it, discouraged men. I like that. Well, goodbye, Alden, or should I say, adieu. Oh, adieu, Josiah. Okay, we're going to rob a stagecoach again. Yay. Let's see how what good this coach the is. Hell? I thought you might like to see that pantomime. River Road through Siltwater Strand, he said. I can scare That wasn't very okay. nice. That wasn't my I horse. I think I know a good spot to wait. Follow me. Okay, let's go. This way. Take it easy, man. I'll follow you, Trelawney. I think you know where we're going. can be. Seems a lot of the station workers are in on it these days. Earning a pittance, the unions are whipping them up, so they want something on the side. Like he said, there, strawberry. Could create a lot of opportunities for a man in your line of work. I ain't sure about going back to strawberry after all that market business. Didn't sound like you left anyone alive to recognize you, so I wouldn't worry too much, dear boy. All this trouble. You gentlemen are becoming quite the celebrities, aren't you? Soon you'll be on the front of a dime novel. And dead, of course. We're hoping to be long gone before that. Dutch has a plan. If anything goes wrong, let's meet back here at this crossroad, okay? All right. Does he have a plan? I don't know if I believe that or not. What do I have? I have... Here we are! This is the spot. Okay! This should do! Sure. Here. I'm hoping we won't need those. Uh. Better safe than sorry. What were you thinking? Well, 
According to this, the loot is located in a strong box, which is in the back. I'll put on a little performance, and you can scurry around, open the strong box, and relieve them of their goodies. And how do I open the strong box without threatening someone to open it for me? This should work. Lockpick? <laughs> and I can do this silently? Well, I'm hoping complete silence won't be necessary. But you're going to wish you had your earplugs. This is Damson. Oh, very good, old, and very good. Of course, if anything goes wrong, you can wave your guns around like you normally do. Hold tight. They'll be here soon. Wait for the catch. There it is. Right on time. Let's go. Keep your distance so they don't see you. And please leave that gun in its holster for once. I don't want to give Navy Seals, because that's what I do, but... What? Is that not the stagecoach? So this is actually gonna work. Oh, Miss why did you stop singing? The New York audience, they were rather cruel. New Yorkers are pretty cool. Wait, what is the fourth guy? Don't know anything about culture. I couldn't agree more. Would, could, could you? It's it's such a small show. But would you sing something for me? I'm looking for a mezzo soprano. Uh, I, 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 I don't know. Miss Damson, you owe it to West Elizabeth. Oh, there's a fourth guy. Yeah. I just walk up right up to it. I got a train to catch. Oh, would you be quiet, you horrible little man? One more time, from the top. Madam, I've heard enough. Might I have your card? The event is on the 23rd of this month. I can't say enough, but Mrs. Damson, Magnifique. So sorry, gentlemen, for the interruption. Farewell. It actually worked. I'm kind of shocked.
Well done, sir. Well done. It was easy. You did all the work. Teamwork, my dear boy. Teamwork. Here you go. Thank you. Oh, it's only good. Go see Alden from time to time. See you soon, Arthur. Okay, this mission was a lot. Heck? What just happened? Yeah, uh... Bit confusing. Turn them on to save problems. Alright. Now, one thing we've discussed several times is challenges and how ridiculous they are. So... What up, five townsfolk? Like, that means we need to find a settlement that we can do it and that we won't get in trouble. Which doesn't exist right now. We either have to go back to strawberry or something. Um, explore. We have to find a treasure. Well, screw that for now. Game we're gonna play. Blackjack? Berry. We gotta kill three small rabbits to get perfect pelts, which are the small game errors, which we don't get yet. There's a lot of problems here. So, my theory is we're kind of in a stuck when it comes to challenges right now. Because I don't think I'm allowed to craft stuff yet. And that's going to be the problem. So let's go ahead and visit he Jose. I almost said Hector. Because I had Hector on the brain. I do need to find berries. Which shouldn't be that hard. That simple. Stagecoach information. I don't need stagecoach. I guess I don't know how to craft in this game yet either, which would probably be a good thing to learn, but I don't know if I can craft yet. Because what I've figured out is I don't think that Tomahawk has the range for it. So I feel like, I know there's improved Tomahawks, and we just gotta get that. That's too many people. I can't hold anybody up anyway. We would have to go to a town like Strawberry or something, which wouldn't be bad. I can just pull this off. I get back. There's another guy up there. <laughs> I have three grand? When did I get three grand? That's not what I'm looking for, but 
Oh, Indian tobacco is right there. Okay, that kind of was interesting. Um, because that was a random event. I think what we'll do is we'll end it here next time on Red Dead Redemption. We will do this mission with Hosea. I'll see you then.